So let's take a real case where somebody, where a student did speak up. It's a medical surgical unit. The team is rounding on the patient. The nurse who's responsible for the patient, again, she's got 100 things to do in eight hours. She's running around. She's busy. She's got a sick patient going to the ICU. She's supposed to hang a unit of blood. She runs in the room. She looks at Mrs. Chilmark's ID bracelet. She thinks it's verified, but she doesn't do the double check to verify. The team's standing in the room. The nurse brings in a unit of blood, plugs it into the IV. She's starting to flush the blood through the tubing. And the nursing student raises her hand and says, you know, I, I don't think this patient's supposed to get blood. And in fact, she wasn't. So they avoided a potentially lethal event. So if we think about what made that student comfortable to speak up, she worked on a team where she felt respected. They invited input. They had told her there's no such thing as a dumb question. You have any question, you see anything that strikes you, concerns you, you need to raise your hand and tell us. And in fact, she did. And she, she cr contributed great value, not only to the team, but also the hospital and the care of the patient.